All right, what's up, guys, and welcome back. It's that time of year again where we get to finally play the official release of a brand new Call of Duty. So welcome to Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Now, I know the campaign wasn't the greatest nor the strongest, but uh, I have high hopes for the multiplayer, considering that we've got all the classic MW2 maps. That in itself, it's going to be pretty fun to relive and re-experience whether the campaign was crappy or not, which I, I still think the campaign is perhaps one of the worst I've ever played. Um, but I did enjoy the beta, not going to lie. And uh, although I haven't played much, I'm excited to come back, play my first game or so, see how it goes. It's probably going to be really terrible. I'm going to try and get into it this year. I know it's been a minute, but uh, we'll see how it goes, man. No promises. Let's just have fun, enjoy the moment. Thank you for joining me. And let's do this. As most of you know, when the full game is out, I like to go solo. So I'm going to go to quick play and I'm just going to enable. I also kind of enjoy kill confirm. I'm not going to lie, but I, I, I've been wanting to play some free for all for a minute. It's going to bring me back to the good old MW2 days for sure. Probably the gameplay won't be as good, but it is what it is. Uh, we are officially retired, so we've got an excuse. We've got the operators tab. These are all the operators. Um, I think I'm probably. Ooh. Wait, so they actually. Do the operators from the last Call of Duty cross over or what the hell? I like this. I mean, not gonna lie, Ghost looks fucking badass. So does Price. But I, I, I want something a little bit uh, more sleek. I'll go with this. Oh, so you mean to tell me I can practice? That would have been cool if you could go over there and just kind of roam around or grab these weapons for that matter. I think that would have been pretty sweet. Leave it to Sledgehammer to include a firing range. Of course they would. By the way, for those of you that don't know, you can actually play the game now, even though the global launch is going to be later on uh, midnight. But, for example, if you are on console, you can go over to the Call of Duty.com website, go to your profile, basic settings, and change your country to New Zealand. And you can play now. Let's go. Uh, this is exciting. This is exciting. I'm just interested to see how the maps are going to play out with, with the movement in this game because the movement is much quicker. Sorry, dude. I think you're dead. <laughs> you had no way out of there. I'm sorry. Yeah, I think like this. I think this map will feel now a bit smaller. That the movement has changed was that all about i gotta be very very careful uh this is obviously a good spot dude i was trying to blow up the bar i was clearly trying to shoot the barrel these footsteps are killing me this map looks beautiful though like oh, we gotta sweat we gotta fucking sweat over there Yeah, this map is looking real nice. When we're playing right now, when I'm playing, I feel like most of the players are going to be a little bit on the better side just because the only people that are really doing this whole New Zealand thing where you can actually play before launch are the people that play this game for real. Like the casuals like you and me, we don't typically do this. <laughs> okay. Cannot believe we, we got an entire Call of Duty with Modern Warfare 2 maps. From start to finish. That is crazy. I feel like they've added more recoil to this gun in the official release. I'm, I'm not sure. Am I going crazy? Shouldn't have followed me, bro. Alright. Wow. Wow. Alright, the sweats are coming in hard. You're almost in the lead. 
I'm still kind of in this belief at how nice and saturated the colors are looking in this in this game right now. I mean, really, really nice. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. I'm done. Wow. How oh, he didn't kill me, I don't know. You know, it'd be interesting to see if they they plan on bringing back some of the old school Modern Warfare 2 weapons. I know some of them are already here, like the UMP or whatnot, but even variants that look identical to the ones in uh, the original Modern Warfare 2. I think that with these maps would make the game feel like Modern Warfare 2 has truly just been remastered or remade, excuse me. That would be really cool. Like the FAMAS, the intervention. I mean, they've already got the base work, the ground work, which is the maps. The fact that I'm losing a free-for-all game is, is kind of embarrassing. I'm actually quite triggered. <laughs> I can't believe I'm losing a free-for-all game. Let's go inside. Okay, are we good? Got a UAV here. Let me pop that. I didn't even realize I had a UAV. Somebody here. He dead. What? Right now I'm playing and, and my aim just doesn't feel right. I feel like I just I just gotta play the game more. Even though I'm not doing the greatest, and I should probably be a little bit disappointed in myself, I'm really liking the way the game's playing. Like it it feels nice. There's a gun there I want. Where is it? Where's that gun? There's a gun there that I want. Where is it? This fucking guy. I think we're in first place. No, we're still tied. I don't care how I win. The matter is, <laughs> I gotta win. Fuck, not good. This guy's here. Oh shit. Oh, we got it. We got it, boys. We got it. Somebody's here. Somebody's here. All right, well, we got the dub. Not the greatest dub, but we got the dub. If I would have lost my first free-for-all match, I probably would have turned everything off. I'm, I'm going to just be honest. And truth be told, I, I really did not play the beta much. I, I made, what, like one, maybe two videos, and I didn't really play much after that. 2.73 KD is pretty bad, especially for the first game. Typically, because the first game is kind of like the easiest, but I'm going to be honest. I, I just... I don't feel like myself. But I'm gonna keep playing. Holy smokes. This is rundown? Free for all. Weapons free. Clear what? Yo, that's sick, dude. Probably should have done an assassination. You think I'd have the advantage that I know all these maps, right? <laughs> But I, I clearly do not. Fucking hell. Whenever you see these characters in like sports gear, you know they're sweats. Like there's, there's no denying it. They're fucking sweats. I just, I don't know what happened. These footsteps are too, too loud, man. Somebody down below. Might be a good spot to chill. There he is. There he fucking is again. That fucking... There's always one fuck. There he 
There he is again. Oh, he's got that UMP. This could be the hot spot, isn't it? Let me try that shit out. Damn, this UMP's got barely any recoil. What gun is this? I'm just out here trying guns, bro. That's all I'm doing. Another crossfire. Shit. Yo, I've got the wrong weapons right now. I'm telling you. Probably ought to get out of there for a bit. This UMP is pretty fucking nasty. Down below. Yo. Yo, this UMP is nasty, bro. Wow, the recoil on this thing is real nice. Nah, bruh. <laughs> Yo, let's go. All it takes is a few games. That's all. There's somebody coming. 11th kill. Oh, they brought back the, uh, the kill counter. Oh, thank God. Where we at? Fuck. I think what I'm most depressed about now is losing all those weapons. Yo, let me get that. Fuck. See, this one's nice. That first one... It's funny because right now this map is playing exactly how I played in the original. Pretty similar to the original ones because I've been on that spot for a hot minute. Seems like this little area back here is the hot spot for this lobby. Typically that's what happens in free for all. You find a hot spot everybody goes to. One thing about free fraud, everybody wants to get revenge on the person that last killed them. So when you patrol and dominate an area for a minute, everybody just wants to go there. And that's the type of shit I like. That's what I find uh, fulfillment in. <laughs> oh shit, somebody down below. Ooh. Got him. Let me get that. All right, cruise missile. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get it. 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 He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, shit. All right. That was the last kill. Back in line, bro. This feels pretty. This feels exactly how I thought it would feel so far if they brought back Modern Warfare 2. This is nice. This is nice. 30 and 7. Okay, we vastly improved from our first initial game. I might be playing this a bit more than I thought. I'm definitely going to try my best to keep playing, whether I make videos or not. I don't know. We'll see how this video does, but I'm probably going to be playing tonight as well with my friends. Maybe the day after. I don't know. We'll see how it goes, but I like this. I really enjoyed my time with these two matches in this game. I love how vibrant it is, and uh, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, how this video does. Keep it locked. Stay tuned. If you guys would like to see more MW3 here on the channel, let me know. And uh, again, thank you for your time. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.